Hello YouTube. I just had to <clears throat> remind myself of why I do not watch the NFL no longer. A uh, little, little background here. I was a Baltimore Colt fan decades and decades ago. And then when they moved to Indianapolis, I stayed with them. Uh, went through the paid Manning years. Uh, but here the past couple of years, I've been like, to hell with this. I ain't watching NFL football no more. But today I said, let me go watch the highlights of the Colts game. They played the Ravens. And uh, so I went and looked, and I was 100% <clears throat> reminded of why I don't watch it no more. Uh, back from time to memorial, you know, at least five decades <clears throat> of football, minimum of five decades, <clears throat> you hear something like, uh, Unitas completed an eight-yard pass to such and such, and they... It's now first and ten with the ball on the 38-yard line. And all I heard here, uh, you could tell it was a black guy and a white guy. Uh, you can kind of tell, you know, how people sound. Uh, so the white guys, they're casting their cells. Gardner Minshew just completed a 38 yard pass. He's selling them up and slicing them down. Uh, you know, three minutes later you hear, uh, go on Rocky, three minutes later you hear, uh, six guys had six sacks last week for the Colts. Are you kidding me? And the black guy, the one that's a secondary guy, I guess the the white guy, the white little fairy was a uh, the play by by play guy, and the black guy was just a general announcer with him. I, I believe I don't know I don't know how this shit works anymore. That's how it would be because he wasn't talking as much, and he's like, "Oh yes, thank you. Oh." He just knocked the heck out of this guy, didn't he? Woo and I'm sitting there going, they have turned the, the, that league into a Lisbon fairy contest. And I hate it. Now, I've been watching football all my life. I'm an old man. Uh, I have physically watched Johnny Unitas play football, not in the stadium, but on TV. Uh, went through guys like Burt Jones, Dan Fouts, uh, yeah, Dan Fouts, Dan Marino, uh, John Elway, Joe Montana, uh, Joe Ferguson. Uh, you know, I could go on and on and on. Vince Evans with Chicago back years ago. One of the... Uh, Harrison with the San Diego Chargers was the first starting uh, black quarterback in the NFL. I was watching this back then. Uh, before him, you had John Hadle, a great quarterback. Kenny Stabler, uh, some years later. And uh, I've watched it all, uh, up to Peyton Manning and, uh, and, and more recent ball. But I ain't watching this shit no more. I'm not going to sit around and listen to effeminate men that were hired over f real football guys to do the sport. And I'll tell you what, if Tyson Fury comes out again with a, uh, the little saucer clicking belly dancer uh, fairy at the beginning of a, a, a boxing fight, I won't be watching his ass no more. I'll just go down the line one at a time, and I'm not watching it no more. Uh, 
I don't give a damn if this world has passed me by. That shit ain't normal. It ain't psychologically sane. And it's not right. And I refuse to let a small group of individuals command what the hell I watch and what I don't watch. I have a choice and I choose not to watch uh, the NFL no more. I wrote off basketball a long time ago with them flaming liberal idiots and LeBron James and all the bullshit associated with him and half that league. Uh, and I'm not doing this no more. And I've loved football all my life. And boxing will be next. Start putting these little effeminate flamers on the announcing for the boxing, and I'll be gone out of that. I won't be watching it. You know, may participate in it, but I'll, I'll be damned if I'm going to sit and watch a bunch of effeminate men uh, on television or pay-per-view or anything else announcing my sports to me. And you younger people, you probably have grew up and this is all you've heard talk because it's all in the news. Uh, half the news you turn on. And if it's not a whisper uh, or a sissy whisper, uh, it's like that's a prerequisite to be hired or something. And uh, I'm just not going to partake in it. I'm old as hell. And uh, I ain't going to cotton to that damn mess. So you can go do what you want. You can go sit in church around it. Uh, you know, down at the local Baptist church or whatever. I ain't taking part in a damn lick of it. For nothing. Or nobody. Sick to death of it. Sick of every movie I watch. It being a girlfriend and a girlfriend. Or a boy and a boy and his boyfriend. Uh Big horror movie buff I've been all my life. I don't even watch half of that shit no more. And can't nobody even write anything no more. Uh, there's no creativity no more. They remake an old movie and they mess the movie up. It's all the hell. Because you got flamers running around all over. Uh, it just, this world's getting to where it just damn well sucks. And we all need to be saying something about it.